Previously, it took us quite a few steps to install Pushbots in our Android application, um, but this is all history now with Pushbots command line interface. So let me show you how this magic works. Step one, let's create a new Pushbots project. Let's call it Simple Test. Um, I'm going to go to Platform and add my Android GCM API key. Step two, let's create a new Android Studio project. Let's make it Android Studio, start a new, let's call it Simple Test. While it's building, let's do step three, which is install Pushbot's command line interface. So let's go to terminal and type npm install pushbots command line interface dash cli dash g because we're not global I'm just adding sudo just in my case but you, you should be okay without it alright it's installed so let's just make sure it works push boats help and it's working step 4 let's go to our Android project under studio click terminal right here I'm just gonna use it because right now we're in the root of this folder so I, I don't need to navigate anywhere and all I need to do is just type push boats install and that's gonna ask me for my app ID my app secret which I have here and my GCM center ID and literally that's it let's run this project so let's choose the emulator now it's installing the app and it's running so let's check the log So right here it's registered, let's go to our dashboard, and we have one new device. To make things a little bit more exciting, let's go back to Android Studio, Terminal, and type pushbots test. And it has sent us a new push notification. This is completely mind-blowing. Uh, they are able to get push notifications for your app from the command line in a few seconds and test it immediately. I hope you like this and stay tuned for more updates.